Meet Anna. She is a farmer who is extremely concerned about the impact of her activities on the environment, the quality of her products, and the sustainability of the agricultural and food system as a whole. The EU livestock sector is the largest in the world. Manure is by far the largest nutrient-rich residual biomass flow generated by this sector. This important biomass stream needs to be upgraded into tailor-made organic and mineral fertilizers that can better comply with the nutrient requirements of different crops to minimize losses to the environment. Europe's livestock industry generates around 1,400 million tons of manure annually. Manure is rich in nitrogen, phosphorus, potassium, and also in micronutrients, and the organic material contained in manure also promotes soil structure, soil quality, and soil biodiversity. However, the traditional practice of spreading raw manure on agricultural fields is now facing a number of challenges. Raw manure is not as reliable as conventional synthetic mineral fertilizers. Manure contains large amounts of water, which makes its transport expensive. Furthermore, it can only be used on farms that are located near the source of manure. In many European regions, the amount of manure that is generated exceeds the nutrient needs of local agriculture, and its application is restricted by environmental legislation, leading to management problems. The production of mineral fertilizers from non-renewable mined rock deposits and those based on fossil energy have contributed to food security for the world's growing population. However, current dependency of EU agriculture on scarce resources like natural gas and rock phosphate must be regarded as a very serious threat and challenge to future food security. Anna and her peers are increasingly aware and concerned about it. The Ferti Manure project offers real solutions to current challenges relating to the inefficient use and management of livestock manure. Ferti Manure seeks to provide an innovative circular economy model to favor rural development in the agricultural sector by creating real synergies and links between farmers and the fertilizer industry. Ferti Manure will propose innovative integrated solutions towards achieving a zero-waste manure management approach. This will include demonstrating novel technologies for making new types of valuable fertilizers and providing evidence-based information regarding the quality and performance of the different end products obtained in order to ensure their market uptake. Evidently, the products will also be field tested as substitutes for synthetic mineral fertilizers, with particular attention given to their agronomic and environmental properties. The Ferti Manure project will provide valuable information, relevant not only to farmers like Anna, but also to policymakers, allowing for the next step to be taken towards a circular economy. Ferti Manure is a project that is led by Beta Technological Center at the University of Vic in Catalonia, Spain, and brings together 20 partners from seven EU countries, Argentina and Chile. It includes universities, research centers, cluster organizations, public bodies, SMEs and NGOs. Ferti Manure is an 8.4 million euro project co-funded by the European Commission under the H2020 program.